Hey guys, and welcome to Minecraft Tornado Survival, Season 8, Episode 4, I believe it is. Yeah, I believe we are on Episode 4. Um, let's turn down the weather. Actually, we can have it at about 40%. So yeah, we have a hailstorm. Yeah, this is either episode 4 or 5, I don't remember, but yeah. And yeah, you guys, I know I did say that I was going to make um, a tutorial video on how to get this mod, how to get the localized weather mod. I'm probably going to do that this weekend. We'll see. So far, I've only had a couple people request, or not request the video, but like ask how to get the mod. So, I don't know, I may wait for more people to ask about that, or I might just record it. Maybe I'll just record the video. Maybe I'll just make the video, just so that if anyone else in the future asks how to get the mod, um, I'll have a video up about it, about it already. So, yeah. And a lot of other Minecraft Tornado Survival YouTubers have made a tutorial video on how to get the mod at some point. I have not done that yet, but, you know, it's something I'm probably going to have to do at some point, just like other Minecraft Tornado Survival YouTubers. So yeah. I'm probably going to do it this weekend, because it's the three-day weekend. I get MLK Day off. Oh, there's a funnel cloud over there. And it's a tornado. I think it's... I think now that it's a tornado, it's going to turn back towards us. So, I don't know. Maybe I should pause my house building. Because, yeah, that's probably going to start coming towards us now. And, by the way, you guys, the... So, this is still... So, believe it or not, the mod has had an update. I know it doesn't look much different. But... There has been updates to this mod recently, like I think last week there was an update. Um, and radars are now a thing, but they don't really... I don't know if they work, like that's the thing. Because I tested out the weather radars in like a... In like a world... In like a non-recorded world. And, like, they didn't really, they didn't really work. And, like, I'd right-click them and they'd always say 0% chance of storms in the area. Because, um, at this point, they're supposed to say the chance of storms that cover your area if you right-click on the radar. But it always says 0%, even if there's clearly a tornado outside. Like, there'd be this tornado outside like this, and then I'd right-click the radar, and it'd say 0% chances of storms in your area. And I'd be like, what the heck? Like, what? what is that? So, yeah. Um, we're gonna have to shelter in here if that tornado comes over here, because we don't have... I don't think... Oh. Oh gosh. I know this isn't a good view, but you can kind of see through the door. 
the tornado picking up blocks from the village. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Goodness gracious. to go right there. It's pretty close. It's like right there. It's like right down the hill. I'm surprised I can't hear it. Could be because my volume's low. But this thing is like right there. Is it safe to go out? Oh yeah, it's safe to go out. It's a little further than I thought. But you saw it destroy that house down there. There's a sunset turn out. It's pretty darn close. It's like right over there. It's like right there. That is scary. That was scary. So I think so the ceiling is going to be on this level, but um, I'm going to put like stairs starting right here. And I'll end right here. So we're going to go so I have them all ready. that out. There it goes. There goes that tornado. That was pretty crazy. Like, we actually saw it destroying a village house in the distance. It was not that far. It was, like, right there. Like, that was not far at all. I'm surprised it wasn't close enough to pick us up. Like, that looked plenty close enough to pick us up. I mean, it wasn't the closest call we had, but it was pretty darn close. There's a pig on my ceiling. So, then right here, the ceiling is going to raise. And I was thinking of also, um, this is my little basement. Do I have torches or no? Do I even have a chest? I don't even have a chest. Okay, we're gonna have to change that. Okay, it's a little weird how I can see the frame on this side, but I can't on this side. It's a little weird, but we'll leave it like that for now. Um, so this is my basement. Will I still be able to come through here? No. I don't want to place it. 
actually, you know what I'm doing? Yes, that's the orientation I want. That's the orientation I want. So if we just do this, then we should still be able to get up and down just fine. shouldn't be able to see. Oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. We shouldn't be able to see the opposite. Okay, there we go. That works. It bugs me how we can see the frame on this side. There we go, that's better. There, yeah, that's better. So the basement doesn't have to be that big either. And then tornadoes will be able to suck us out of this basement, but it is a little bit safer. It's kind of weird how I have my bed off the wall like this. I think my bed is gonna be right here. I think that's where my bed's gonna be. I can see the tornado through my non-existent windows. Well, we're gonna change that. I'm gonna make some windows. So my crafting bench is actually gonna go... I have two crafting benches right now, but that's okay. Crafting bench will go there. Furnaces will go here. You know what, we don't need torches here because we have torches down in the basement. Um, yeah, I can make, I'll make two more furnaces. And then we'll just do that and that works. And for chests, we'll have them. Chests will go in the corner right here. Then I'll just dump all of the stuff I don't need in here. And our house, actually no, there's something we're still missing. Our house is not actually complete just yet. Because I forgot to do something. I forgot to make some railing for the balcony. So I gotta do that before this house can be called complete. We really need to go more hunting because I do not have a lot of food. That is a task for next episode. Now, if we have time, we may start mining next episode as well. We'll see. So yeah. 
This episode, I want to finish up with the house, though. I mean, I know it's getting close to the time to end off the episode, but I don't want to be working on the house next episode. Like, this is the last episode that I want to work on the house, that I want to use to work on the house for now, at least. So, yeah. Need to finish it this episode. Is that a new tornado? I think that's a new tornado. Um, okay, this needs to be extended right here. It's probably coming towards us. our little balcony right here and then I need to get some sand okay, I also need to make sure you know what I don't like how it's so dark so first I'm gonna put torches right here and then I'm gonna make more torches And then put them... Yeah, I just don't like how it's dark on this side of the house. I know I said I wasn't going to put torches there, but I changed my... Oh, shoot. Are you kidding me? He didn't even chase me. I hate creepers. Now you guys probably see why I hate creepers. They're so annoying. In my opinion, they're the most annoying mob in the game. At least I have enough wood to repair this. But now my way up is completely ruined. I hate creepers so much. Creepers are bad. They are my least favorite Minecraft mob. You guys can probably see why. Okay, that'll work for now. So in the morning, I'm gonna get glass and finish up the house. Then after that, so thank goodness the creeper did not do like severe damage to the house. Okay, that tornado's on its way, but I'm hoping I can get the house done before it comes. So thank goodness that creeper did not do serious damage to the house. It just broke the floor a bit, but luckily we had enough, luckily we had enough wood planks to fix it. Okay, the lag is not great. I do not appreciate the lag that I'm experiencing right now, but that's okay. I'm actually going to get 12 sands just in case. Okay, I really want to finish this house, so this episode may end up a little bit on the long side, but... Did I not waypoint my house? Why did I not waypoint my house by now? Okay, well, I'm gonna do that when we get inside. But yeah, this episode may end up a bit on the long side, but 
I really want to finish my house this episode because I don't want to spend another episode on it. I think this is already our third episode in a row working on the house. And we need to we need to start moving on to other things. That's what I'm trying to say. We've got to start doing other things, and that's what we're gonna do next episode. Next episode we're also gonna go hunting because I do not have a lot of food. So hopefully that tornado does not hit this house. Probably won't, but you just never know. So we just need to wait for this to smelt and then when it does we can finish the house. It's a little bit weird up here, but it's okay. You kind of see the platform. Oh, it's like twin tornadoes. Gotta take a screenshot. I'm taking a lot of screenshots with this mod because the tornadoes just look so good in this mod. They really do. But yeah, again, um, I'm going to be releasing a video likely this weekend on how to install the weather mod because a couple of people already asked how to install it and more people are probably going to ask it future so just to be prepared for well just to answer the question of how to get the mod like a couple of people already asked and for future reference as well I will make a video so there's a new storm but that is a problem for the next episode so yeah, the glass is done smelting, so these are just going to be our spare panes. So this episode is already long enough, so I'm going to just end it here. So, oh, I was going to dye my bed, but you know what? We can do that next episode. The goal was just to finish the house. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and goodbye.